Hello everyone, I'm Amit from Mail Smartly. Recently, one of my viewer asked me a question. Can we use symbols or emojis in the email subject line? The answer is absolutely. There are four ways you can use to insert an emoji in your subject line. So let's get started and understand all the four options. So first click on the new email. I directly jump to the subject line. The first option is you can use your hotkeys. You can display the hotkeys using your keyboard shortcut, which is window period. You can also use windows semicolon. So just take an example with windows period. So you will see a small dialog box appears. Here you have to simply enter your specific emoji name in the search bar. So I just type smiley. So you will see when I type S M I L, all the emojis with smiley faces are appear here. So all I have to do is to simply select the one I want to insert in my subject line and hit your mouse left button. As soon as you select the one, the emoji is entered in your subject line. The only problem is the emojis which you enter in your subject line will be a pure black and white. So you cannot enter a colored emoji in your subject line. The second option is copy and paste. Sometimes we have our specific emoji available in my some document, or if you don't, you simply directly jump Google, simply hit google.com, type a, an emoji like smiley emoji, hit enter, select images, and select the one you want to enter in your subject line, See this one, I simply hit mouse right button, hit copy images. I come back to my outlook, simply use your control V or use your mouse right button to paste your emoji here. The third option is character map. This character map is an inbuilt feature which you can use to insert emojis on your outlook subject line. You will see on the bottom of my screen, I have a search bar, simply type character. There is an option character map, select it. This is an inbuilt feature available in your windows. So here you will see tons of options here. All you have to do is to select this advanced view. You have to select it. That will open few options here. And here you have to select Unicode, which is already selected in my case. Now group by. Currently all is selected. You have to simply use Unicode sub range that will automatically open a group of small options here. Here again, scroll down a little bit and you will get an option which is symbols and ding bands. When you click on it, you will see few options here. Select the one you want to insert that will zoom a little bit. Hit select from here that will appear here. Now simply hit copy. And again, use your control V button to paste it. So your emoji is very easily pasted using your character map option. The last and the final option, which, which is my favorite one is using Unicode. Unicode is a specific code with a combination of alphabets and numeric values. So there are tons of different emojis and for every emoji, there is a specific Unicode. So I will show you a couple of one. So if you want to enter a smiley face with hearts, what you have to do is to simply type one F nine seven zero and hit alt X that will convert your specific Unicode in, into a emoji. But remember the alphabet you type will be on the upper case. Now take another example. I want to enter angry face. So what I have to type one F six two zero again, hit alt X and you will see your angry face is replaced the Unicode. That way you can enter your emojis with different, different faces into your subject line using Unicode. I use all these four options to insert the emojis in my subject line while creating a new email while replying or forwarding an email to my recipient. 
If you have learned something new from this video, please like and subscribe my YouTube channel. And please don't forget to click on the bell icon so you will never miss out any Outlook tips and problem solvers videos I come up with. Also share which one you like the most in the comment section. Thank you and have a nice day.